Let's just talk about how this is the third time that I'm gonna try to have a channel. Like, I'm not even kidding. I tried like two years ago, don't know what happened. I tried again last year. This is the third time. They say that the third time, you know, you know, that. So this time we're gonna talk about stuff that makes me. I don't know if this channel is gonna be a beauty channel yet. I don't know if it's gonna be an everything channel. I don't really know if it's gonna be a f around channel, but to be completely honest with you guys, no one was home, so I'm like, yeah, let's shoot a video. So while we're home alone, let's talk about the stuff that I think is cool. This YouTube channel wouldn't be a YouTube channel if I didn't mention Lush. Good words. Right here. Come on, work with me. How do people freaking do this freaking focus thing? This is Mint Julep's Lip Scrub. By everybody's favorite thing ever, Lush. It smells like mint. I don't know what else to tell you. And it's a lip scrub, so you just kind of scrub it on there. And I think, do a lot of people think that's gross? Like, it says on here that you can lick off the excess. That's licking dead skin. I feel like I'm, I'm embarrassed to tell people that I like this because it's like, oh uh, yeah, I like to scrub this on and then lick the dead skin off. Hmm, let's talk about this. This is a tangle teaser. You see all the hair in there? That was awesome. I like it because I can fit it in my purse and it's really super easy and that little thing down there keeps all that hair from getting around my purse. Good for brushing hair. I don't know what to do with my hands. Johnson's Baby Lotion. We're gonna go the entire video and we're not even gonna know if I'm in focus or not. I like this stuff for everything. I like to use it on my face and my body and my hands and I like how it smells. It smells like babies. Dem babies smell good. Creeper. Just to break it up a little bit, let's talk about something that's not makeup. <laughs> this is my planner. It's the Kate Spade 2016 uh, planner. <laughs> if people put notes in their phones, I can't do that shit. I really like writing stuff down. Do you see that? Do you see all the nonsense going on right there? And I sincerely doubt that I'm going to be doing a plan with me channel and making a brand new channel just for my planner. I, I don't... It's not gonna happen, guys. This is what I do in my spare time. I talk to your camera and I draw pictures in a book. Can I go a little basic bitch on you real quick? Coffee! I will say I don't go to Starbucks though, not a lot. I like to make it in my own house. This is my favorite mug. It's like Tim Burton-y. Do you see the font on there? How it's like super tall and skinny? It's awkward shaped. Me. More basic! This is a MAC lipstick in Japanese maple. I really like the nude colors, especially the ones that make my lips just look not red. I've always had that weird thing, like ever since middle school, I would literally put foundation on my lips. I don't like red lips, I can't pull them off. I don't know if it's just because of the freckles, do the freckles throw it off? I don't know. I prefer the lipstick that makes me look like a dead person. This brush! Let's do the little focusy thing again. Whatever, it's an angled brush by MAC, okay? This brush, right here. This is the MAC 266 brush, and it's a nice little angled brush. I'm probably not gonna be the girl who's like, yeah, I know exactly what this is. This is the MAC 266. I had to look at the number. <laughs> But I use it for my eyebrows. Did I mention I watch a lot of YouTube? One of the girls I watch, makeup girl 92, makeup, I love makeup, I heart makeup 92, f me, what is her name? Now I have to stop and look. I heart makeup 92, sorry Liz. She swears by putting Vaseline on her eyelashes. This is one of those little tiny pots that you find in like the dollar section at Target. I legitimately take my makeup off at night and rub this heavily on my eyelashes. She insisted that it makes them grow and it makes them healthy. I swear, I'm not lying, I'm just, please be right. I don't wanna be remembered as the weird girl who puts Vaseline on her eyelashes. I'm just trying to see if it works. Why is that flashing? What does that flashing mean? On the topic of YouTubers, I bet a lot of people recognize this. That's my makeup bag, but more importantly, it's the Zoella that's on it. Let's talk about Zoella. She's just so cute. Like, I love her. Can we just for a minute? Zoella is kind of like the reason that I started YouTube. I wish I had an accent as cool as she did, and I shamelessly shop her website all the time. 
Let's talk about for a minute how I'm four years old, basically. I bet you guys know what this is. Swamp Kids Detangler. It's the green apple smell. It smells like childhood. I don't even know if it does anything for your hair, if we want to be really honest about it. It just smells nice. Should we bring me back to adulthood again? Masa! The girls that I work with have started something bad. I have a problem on some days at work, and when I have that problem, this guy, it legit tastes like carbonated Kool-Aid, but it makes you really freaking hyper. If my husband knew I drank that, he'd be like, He's really good at being healthy and I really suck at it. Am I shameless enough yet? No, I'm gonna be a little bit more shameless. Yeah, so what if I'm a Taylor Swift fan? Look at all the pictures. So this is my vinyl copy of Taylor Swift's 1989. I'm acting like I should be embarrassed or something, but you know what? No, no shame. Hashtag no shame. I went to the concert and I sang really, really loud and I lost my voice, but I had a hell of a time. I also have the CD version. It's also never left my car CD player since the day that it came out. Swifty for life. I have no idea what I'm gonna do for my next video, but again, I'm just gonna play it by ear. I don't know what this channel's even going to be about, but if I feel like filming it, I'm just gonna film it. And then we're gonna edit it and put it onto the internet forever and ever. Well, there you go, there's my first video, Stuff That Makes Me. Hope you like it. Peace out, YouTube.